the Secretary General himself, in his own name or through you, comments on, on matters all over the world. It seems like this is a pretty big global story, not only because it's a report about the United States engaging in torture, but because it implies and, and seems to make out many countries which hosted such torture, many of whom are signatories to the convention. So I just wonder, can you say, at least to me it's surprising, and I think to some others, that the Secretary General himself, in the 24 hours since the report came out, has had no direct comment. Why, why is well, that? Well, I, th I think he's directly commenting through me and through what I'm telling you, which is he shares the sentiments expressed uh, by the High Commissioner. I think we obviously welcome, uh, he welcomes the release of, of the report. Um, as I said, this is the start. This should be the start of a process. The issue of accountability is a is a critical one, and obviously, all countries. I think 156 countries that have signed up to the Convention Against uh, Torture um, need to ensure uh, that these practices stop. Does he share the, the sentiments of Ben Emerson, the Special Rapporteur on Counterterrorism, who said there should be prosecutions? Directly? I think you know if you look at what the High Commissioner said, and again, I talked about the the start of a process. Uh, I think the fact that this um, this report uh, was released uh, to the public is an important step. Um, and we, as we said, we hope this is the start of a process. Edie.